Harris with a lot to prove this season. Steelers did not pick up his fifth year option. Pressure dumped off. Harris makes the play and he eludes. Uh, would be tackling. He gets first down yardage and more. Third and four now as Fields operates from the shotgun. Looking left. And he's hit from behind and he goes down. And that is Daniil Hunter. There are a few changes here as we see now a third and eight. Stroud delivers right on the money and that goes to Tank Dell. Dell makes his way into the end zone eluding tacklers for the touchdown. It's C.J. Stroud to Tank Dell. 36 yards on a third and eight. And the Texans are on the board. Stroud knows exactly where he's going right here on the skinny post right there. And Anthony Avery. In the offensive line game, a lot of change to that offensive line over the last two years. Here's Fields with time. Fires over the middle. And he has his man, Van Jefferson. And that is a strike of 20 yards from Fields to Jefferson. This year, you only need one right. This time, Fields under pressure. And he's going to go down in the pocket. Good pressure by the Texans right there, and that results in another loss. There have been several of those so far. Seven yards this time. Houston has the lead. They're also facing a third down here. Davis Mills under pressure, and he goes down. The sack is... They're getting some experience tonight, which is great. and uh, So this will be an important uh, preseason for those guys as they learn how to work together. Look at Jonathan Ward go, and this kid has been very impressive from Central Michigan. Kyle Allen now in the game at quarterback stands in there makes a throw and it's right on the money a huge gainer right there to Des Fitzpatrick out of Louisville in his own end zone this time using that leg of his to try to get something deep and he does oh my he drives Quez Watkins back and he muffs it and the Texans have recovered it Quez Watkins we've seen a lot of misplays so far that was another 57 yard boot there. Houston trying to add to a 7 0 lead. The Steelers trying to get off. Here comes Mark Robinson. Davis Mills gets away from it, goes to Woods, and he's going to get the necessary yards for the first down. As we get inside of four minutes left in this first half of play, and a, another pitch, and this one goes to Agumba Wale, and he follows his blocking into the end zone. That's a four yard touchdown for Dare Agumba Wale, and the Texans have increased that to 13 0. It's down that was on that play. He's just looking at his defense and saying, what are you doing? 36-yard attempt right here. And it's good. So 17-0 with three seconds left in this first half. Des Fitzpatrick in the game now on a second and seven. For Kyle Allen, the quarterback, some pressure coming out, and he escapes it. Looks down the field, throws, and has a man. And it's Calvin Austin who gets to the 50-yard line, and that's going to be a big gainer of 25 yards and a first down for the Steelers. On his Steelers team. And now they line him up to the wide side on the second and 11 play. Shotgun. Allen throws, and he has a man there, and it's going to be good for a nice gainer here as the Steelers move on. That's Jere Jenkins. Tariq Black is in the game for the Steelers. He's a big guy. And this is Allen going to the outside. Has Connor Hayward, who lunges for the pylon, and he gets it. It's a touchdown for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Hayward. And Matthew Wright will be. They were looking for some gunners, too. They lost some guys who they had in that position uh, in punt formation. So this is all what goes on in training camp. And there's a big play there by Xavier Hutchison. As he gets big yardage, this is going to be a 51-yard field goal for Kai Fairbairn. His career long is 61. And he is right down the middle with this one, so he adds to the lead. It's a great experience. Last summer, it was uh, the summer of Joey versus George. And we're seeing some good stuff happen down here on the field. What has impressed you about the wide receivers on this team? First and goal for the Steelers now with Allen in the shotgun. Handoff up the middle, and it's going to be a touchdown for the Steelers. Edwards finishes what he started. Can have has really done a pretty good job. You know, they've moved some people around. They got a lot of new people in there. So Quez Watkins and Deuce Watts in the game for the Steelers, number 85. Allen. Hit, and he's gonna go down this time. He was trying to pump fake, Charlie, and then all of a sudden everything collapsed around him. All right, so 16 seconds left. Now it's a third down again. They need to have an opportunity to take a shot at the end zone here at some point. Pressure from the outside. Allen over the middle. Intercepted. It's overthrown. Watts was the intended receiver, and it's Brandon Hill. 
out of the University of Pittsburgh. And a Pitt Panther makes a play that is going to seal it for the Texans. Trying to take a shot down the field, which he had to do, just tap it high. Caused the interception there. Hill got up, made a nice return. He's familiar with this place for sure. 37 yards on that return. He almost lost possession of it, but he did come up with it and wanted the return. So victory formation now. And Case Keenum takes a knee, and that's going to do it. And Kyle Allen. Showed something in that uh, second half after the first half was a little slow.